selling the plan to the American people. Recent polls show it's unpopular with the majority of Americans. A new way to do brain surgery is being called safer and may actually help in saving more lives. 13 ABC's Melissa Vates shows us how, all new at 6. Well, Christian, there are few things more delicate than brain surgery. One move in the wrong direction and a patient can end up seriously disabled if they survive at all. So a new way to map brain surgery using GPS is making it safer and more accurate. This is Brain GPS, a new way to do brain surgery. It allows us to do uh, safer surgery in a shorter amount of time. Prometica neurosurgeon Dr. Kevin Renard says this technology allows much more precise mapping of brain tumors or brain bleeds. And then what we can do before we actually ever make an incision, we can utilize a computer to figure out the exact trajectory of attack uh, and also the size of our opening and incision. The different colored lines you see on this screen are vital nerve pathways. If they're cut during surgery, they can cause major damage to bodily functions like movement, memory, and speech. This 3D video screen... We have to align this much like a, a video game or like a fighter fighter would. ...allows brain surgeons to negotiate around these pathways. You can actually see the probe. You see the probe moving around on the surface of the brain? Yeah. And take out tumors. Well, when I'm on the tumor on the screen, right. it tells you exactly virtually where you are in relationship to all, the to all the nerves without causing damage it's easier and safer and then you're able so you're in there now and then you're able to just resect the whole tumor exactly this technology can also be used on spinal surgeries to repair damaged discs and bleeding on the brain any surgery where a microscope is used uh, the microscope can be swapped for this device for this yeah now, this type of surgery will make it more likely to remove some tumors that would otherwise be labeled as inoperable because of their location. Melissa H, 13 ABC Action News. Back to you. Amazing stuff. Melissa, thank you. Well, the village of Bluffton has a new mayor, Judy Augsburger.